Hey, hon, you know what day it is? Thursday? No. Hey, hon, you know what day it is? Your birthday? No. Hey, hon, you know what day it is? Our anniversary? No. Hey, hon, you know what day it is? Oh, I give up already. Will you just tell me, please? I don't know what day it is. It's Florida Day! <laughs> oh. Hey, everybody, my name is Sam. And I'm Angela. And we're Green Acre Homestead. We are back in our mobile home here, where we live, as always, and we're doing a mobile home renovation. Today, apparently, is floor day. Yay! Like, <laughs> finished floor, real floor, good floor, put it on the floor floor day. We have had OSB floor for, what, a month? Yeah, or six More? years, either way. <laughs> Feels that way. So finally, we're gonna get real flooring down and make it look finished. All right, so here's a look at the flooring we got. This is SmartCore brand, it's sold at Lowe's. It is 100% waterproof. If you haven't seen it yet, I did a video a couple of days ago about torture testing one of the scrap cutoff samples you get from the store. This did awesome, wonderful. So, like I said in the video, it earned our money and this is what we we're going with. These floor tiles are a 12 by 24, so it's kind of going to be a subway-esque tile floor, maybe like a brick style. So they're going to half lap each other. It is 4.45 in the afternoon right now. So we're going to try and get as much of this done today as we can. We're not going to get the whole kitchen done for sure. But we'll see how far we can get. Sounds good to me. All right, enough talking. Start work. We got work in here going on. We got dishes in the sink. We got a house that's a mess, but you know what? This is reality. It is. It's right here. You are here with us. Can I get you to help, please? Be nice. Be nice. Would be nice. All right, we have got, uh, we'll say two courses done, although it's really not. We got the course here at the wall, and then we got a little thin little strip that goes all the way back to where the stove is. And we're getting ready to lay down the first official full length full course of tile we have gone through what a box one box one box total there's 10 pieces to a box and each box is around 20 square feet so we have 13 boxes total <laughs> we're one thirteenth one thirteenth away through our project all right let's get going let's get going all right she says back to work We have got ourselves a system now and we're cooking with fire. <laughs> I do all the hard cuts and Angel's doing the solid pieces. While she taps it in on the floor, I stand on the existing floor to keep it from moving. Use what God gave me and I've eaten to help out with the floor installation. And it's going pretty smooth so far. <laughs> Don't jinx us.
we figured out that if we take out the fridge and finish this one little piece on the floor right here, we can go ahead and finish the entire dining room. So I think we're gonna do that first to have something completed. We're going to go ahead and do the dining room now. We haven't finished in the refrigerator area, but we don't want to sacrifice a whole piece just to fit the piece in here. So we're going <laughs> to... What? I'm confused and I know what's going on. Well, then you say it. <laughs> All right. What she's trying to say, what I'm going to probably butcher myself, is we need to get another starter piece for inside the fridge cubby. We don't want to sacrifice a full piece for that, so we're going to wait till we have scraps left over from doing the dining room to then finish the fridge cubby. Does that work? Sure. All right. Between the two of us, hopefully you understand what's going on. looks good so we finished the dining room and the last edge we ended up putting the whole row together and then me and sam both work to get it all in at the same time and thank the lord it all went in at the same time and we didn't have to use a hammer or anything to try and get it because there was no room to so thank you lord that it worked It's not a finesse tool. It's not pretty, but at least it's behind the fridge. All right, last piece of the fridge cubby. Of course, we're gonna have to take it out again to Why? the fridge. Why? Paint. Oh, I thought you meant the floor. To cover up these beautiful apple baskets. Hmm? What do you say? Well, I just said, you mean the horrible apple baskets? Yeah. There we go. floor is done. Woohoo! <laughs> that was a lot of hard work. It took us three days to do. Not full eight hour days, but still three days worth of work. And uh, ugh, I'm glad it's done though. It is. You will notice like behind us right here, the dining room has not been touched since demolition started. We didn't get it painted and we still have trim to do, but we wanted to get the floor done first. All of us, including the kids, started getting splinters in our feet from the OSB. So, not too too much fun. No. Mm -hmm. 
So I decided to go ahead and do the floor first and then we can put down some cloths or whatever whenever we decide to paint. Yeah, drop cloths. Which, speaking of paint, that's probably the next thing on our list and that is us painting the cabinets. For those of you who are still out there hoping and praying and hold your breath that we're going to stay in the cabinets, sorry. We've already bought the paint. It's white. They will be white and it'll be great. Appreciate you guys watching as always. If you're not a subscriber, hit that subscribe button and we'll see you next time. I'll about sit in the workshop. No. <laughs> Appreciate you guys watching. We'll see you next time on the homestead. See you guys. <laughs>